Welcome to Todd's Two Minute Tech Tip Tuesday, brought to you by Big Beard Battery. Visit BigBeardBattery.com. Let me set the situation for you. You ever have a problem where you go to an RV park and you either have too much pressure or not enough pressure? You've been told to go ahead and get you that water pressure regulator, and you see that there's really two types out there, one for about $50 and one for about $12. You think, hey, I'm gonna be money conscious, I'm gonna try that $12 one. You go ahead and hook that inline water pressure regulator up, you try to take a shower, and it's like the desert. No water coming out. Well, here's the situation. You know, at RV parks, we're always getting problems with water coming in to too much pressure, maybe not enough pressure, what we want to do is we want to stop what's called a water hammer by using that water pressure regulator. We want to slow the flow of that water down so that way we don't bust your pipes, right? But the problem with these inline water pressure regulators, they're really not strong enough. They can't push the volume you need to take that shower. Well, a lot of people, and I don't understand why we do this. I'm one that does it as well. We still, when we see we have city water hookup, we just simply hook up to city water. But your RV is actually equipped with a holding tank and a water pump. Now for most of us, if we're hooked up to city, we don't use the water pump. And here's the problem that we have. When that water is sitting in that water pump, stagnant, it's gonna get, well, it's gonna get nasty. And we're gonna have to actually clean that out. The best thing that we can do is actually exercise our water pump. And really one of the better things that we can do is every time we pull up to a site, just as a suggestion, Fill up your water tank and use your water pump. You get consistent pressure from your water pump, anywhere from 45 to 55 PSI. That, my friends, you can take a good shower with. I'm gonna pump you up. Oh yeah. Oh, I know I'm on. Are you on? <laughs> let's figure this one out. So let's say, <laughs> now you've also learned to go ahead and get you that, what the hell is that thing called? <laughs> So that way we're not, you know, breaking our, <laughs> so that way we're not actually breaking our, damn, fittings. That's the word. Yeah. So that way we, <laughs> we don't burst your bubble. Burst your pipes. Yeah, bust your pipes. And someone's going to go, it's not the pipes. And then after that, you'll smell better. Why are you looking at me? What was this about? Oh, no, sorry. Are you repeating yourself? I'm, I'm seeing a show. That's still dark.